is not clickbait. I did indeed get dropped by Gymshark. Hello and welcome to today's YouTube video guys. So I'm not gonna beat around the bush. I don't like wasting time, so I'm not gonna waste your time. I have seen some videos, for example, Mo Samuel saying when someone leaves Gymshark, they do typically get dropped. I mean, I'm sure there are circumstances where people do mutually agree to leave Gymshark. However, Gymshark did drop me, so I'm just gonna get straight to it in this video because I've been getting a ton of questions for some of the Gymshark athletes, some of my closest friends. So that's awesome. So it kind of sucks when they're all together, having an amazing time, and obviously I can't be there because I'm not a Gymshark athlete anymore. That sucks, but hey, it's one of those things, and I think life does go on. And I really do think, as cliche as this is, everything happens for a reason. Do you like my mug? It says off duty gym bunny. <laughs> so I've had so many questions asking me, Lauren, have you been dropped by Gymshark? Why aren't you working with Gymshark anymore? I've had some really nice things being like, Lauren, you're the most realistic when it comes to sizing out of the Gymshark athletes I follow. So how come you're not doing Gymshark clothing reviews anymore of all the new stuff? And I'm like, oh, I, would, I need to address this, but I didn't really know how because it's not like I'm angry with Gymshark, it's not like Gymshark are angry with me, it's just one of those things where they essentially phoned me up, one of the guys who's like the sponsorship guy, and he was like, Lauren, look, I'm just, just I'm not going to beat around the bush, I'm just going to cut straight to it, um, we are no longer going to be co continuing your contract, and I was like, oh, okay, really, uh, why? And, um, <laughs> and he was basically just like, your brand no longer matches Gymshark's brand anymore. And I was like thinking, okay, fair enough, like, because I was never doing on my feed kind of always, oh, Gymshark, Gymshark, Gymshark. I think for me, it's really important to also maintain my personal brand rather than all only po posting about another brand. Because personally, I do truly believe that you know, I see my future as a business owner and, you know, I'm really just bloody interested in business, but I'll get to that in a sec. Okay, and then something else that he said was that Gymshark weren't really too happy with the fact that I'm starting my own brand as well. And at this period of time, I hadn't really said anything on social media or to anyone other than the fact that I was launching a new company. Like I was saying earlier in this video, my personal brand is so important to me and I like being able to do products myself. And with that said, I do already have, as you guys know, and a lot of you who are watching this love, and if you do love it, thumbs up this video right now. The Strength Feed Training Guide and also the Ultimate Guide to Tracking Macros. And then today, actually, I am releasing to my email list the Tone Up in 10 training guide, which is a 10 week long training guide, mainly for beginners. So that's really exciting. So that's going up for my email list. Then next week it's gonna be released to absolutely everybody, but you can still get on my email list now. There is a link to it in the description box below, but I will leave a link to my new website, laurentickner.com as well in the description box. A new website with my name, guys. Getting serious now. In 2018, you are indeed going to be seeing some active wear, the strength feed active wear. So that's something that I've genuinely been working on for probably about 18 months. So yes, that has been quite a long time. I've got one of the samples here. There is another sample coming later on this week. So I will show that to you guys. So, I mean, I'm just so excited and they're really, really, really nice leggings. They're gonna be at a decent pricing point. But I tell you now, I had to buy the bulk amount and it's been a big dent on my wallet. So I'm just really excited about that. And there's just a lot of stuff that I'm gonna be doing in 2018 that I just haven't even spoken about on social media yet. This video, I've been dropping a lot of new things. So yeah, I mean, if you could spread the message, that would be great. Tell your friends about this video and I will see you in the next one. Make sure you subscribe because there's a lot of cool stuff coming soon, including a food challenge.